Hey kids, uh, Miss Laura Lee here. We're doing another virtual children's message today. Um, and today we're talking about the word sacrifices. It's a pretty big word. Have you ever heard of it? Uh, sacrifices means that you're giving up something for someone else. It's pretty much, oh, Hi, Nancy. Uh, Nancy is our new office intern. Uh, what's up? I'm actually um, using it right now. Um, sometimes I just like holding it. No, Nancy. No, I. I'm doing. I'm doing a children's message right now, and I'm clearly using. This, the tape is mine, okay? You can't have it, all right? Anyway, sorry about that. She She's new around here and doesn't know the policies, but at least she knocked, at least she knocked. That was good. Anyway, anyway, going back to our, our lesson about sacrifices. Um, sacrifices, or sacrificing, is when you give up something um, for someone. Nancy, you, you can have the you can have the tape. I'm not even using it. <laughs> Interns. Hey, this actually kind of reminds me of our Bible passage today. Um, it's from Mark 8, 34, and it says, And calling the crowd to him with his disciples, he, Jesus, said to them, if anyone would come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me. Christ is telling us that following him is sometimes denying ourselves and maybe some things that we want to sacrifice in order to follow him. This life is not going to be easy for all of us if we follow Christ, but we do have that hope, the greatest hope that he will take care of us and he will be with us and bring us to heaven someday. Now, losing a roll of tape is far less daunting than taking up our cross, denying ourselves and following God. But caring for others and giving up our things or our time is a way to make sacrifices for others. And as we go through life and hard times, we can know that Christ gave the greatest sacrifice when he sacrificed his life on the cross to save us because he loves us. So next time you feel like you have to sacrifice something, maybe it's your toys or your time or something that you want, you can know that Jesus made the biggest sacrifice of all by going to the cross and we can find strength and hope in his death and resurrection as we go through this life together. So let's pray it out. I'll say a line and you can repeat it back to God. Dear God, we want to follow you, but sometimes it requires sacrifice. Help us to follow you and remember you made the greatest sacrifice of all. Thank you for making that sacrifice. We love you so much. Amen.